Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is kg 4 e and welcome back to Occupy Mars. And I just logged into my base and I was lost. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. These signs might be my favorite thing about this game at this point. <laughs> it saved my ass. I'm like, I got to go out to the hangar. Where the heck is the hangar? Where am I? Oh, hold on. Hangar. And that is awesome. Just so cool. Okay, let me go over some of the comments you guys made about last video. Uh, the auto transportation thing does work. You can transport the rover into the hangar. Okay, so I'm gonna have to, where was that? Where was, I think that was under materials? I don't remember, there's some kind of like transportation. Yeah, here we go. So, uh, might be something I wanna look into. I don't know when I'm gonna do it. Uh, I might not do it today though, because I wanna get, I wanna try and use the main HQ and see if that'll help. Also, quickly, let me actually, let's just go to, let's go to our um, workshop, because I'm gonna show you something dope. Apparently making the antenna isn't enough to extend your remote control range, which is kind of odd. Let's just call it odd. I think that's a, I think that's a good way to go. Uh, yeah, you have to like, not only do you have to spec into and make the antenna, but you also, you also have to spec into the ability to use the antenna, which is just doesn't make any sense to me. Increases remote control area. Uh, no, that's not it. Antenna remote control. Wait, what is this then? Is that another one? All right, well, this is what I was looking at. Software update to extend remote control range with antenna system. I, I don't know. I don't know. Mechanics. I don't know what this is for that either. Let's kind of check that out. Available but we will play around with that um, today. Let me go over the rest of the comments first though. Um, move the big crusher. So people want me to move the big crusher, right? And basically just pick it up. And I guess move it right here facing this way. Yeah, it might be a good idea. I think this is a lot more compact, but I don't know. That might be pretty cool. I might do that. Uh, when? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I kind of like that idea. Uh, also, can I link the base? Can I link this base to my survival capsule? That's another thing I wanted to I wanted to know. Not that I would need to or really care, but I'm wondering if I can link this to here. Uh, I don't know. That's it. You know what? I'm going to find out right now. How about that? Honestly, it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it because that won't that won't connect to it. I don't think you can. If I can't connect this to it, then I can't connect anything to it. Can anyone let me? Can anyone let me know if you've ever done that? Like, I don't want to waste a, like time making a big long hallway when I don't think it's gonna work. But if someone says it's definitely possible, I'll do it in a in a future video. Well, I think what we need to do now is we need to go out and grind for some resources. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go down in the hangar. I'm going to grab my my rover and we are going to get out there. And, you know, I'm also going to mess around with the remote control. Do oh, I was like, where's all my stuff? I forgot. Whenever I take screenshots, I turn off the, the HUD. And this time I forgot to turn it back on. <laughs> I'm like, where's all my, where's all my stuff? Oh, God, I got the hiccups. That's not good. Where is the remote control? There it is. All right. So I don't know. Maybe maybe the remote control will work better now with this thing. Even with the extended range, I don't really think it's worth it. But, you know, what else? It's all good. It's all good. Let's unplug it. And same thing I mentioned yesterday, guys. I'm going to keep mentioning it because I don't want people to think I'm ignoring uh, people's chats. I haven't seen your chats yet in last episode. Wait, what? Uh, it's not doing anything now. Oh, that's right. I can't be in my base for some reason. I don't understand that. Right. Looking good. It's not turning. It's not like it's not working properly. There we go. It's weird. Sometimes it works properly and sometimes it doesn't. Uh, we're going to try and drive it over there. Okay, let's see how far we can make this thing go. Mm -hmm. I guess I might as well have it start going to where I want to go. And where I want to go is, like, we're going to go do some grinding. I think the best place to grind in my area is probably still here. There's still stuff to grind there. And that's where I'm going to go. And I'm going to actually see how far this will go. I'm kind of wondering, can I run while I'm controlling this? I don't think I can. No, 
I can only drive it. Now, I can't see the red marker while I'm on my rover, which is a bit of a problem. So where is the rover? Okay, the rover's right there. All right, so we need to... Uh, basically, what we need to do is turn the rover a little bit, a little bit more. Come on. We'll turn it a little bit more. We'll just kind of head this way. Uh, that that did it, guys. That extended the range. This thing's already way, way out. So how do I use the... I'm trying to turn like this, by the way. How do I, like, mine with it, though? Like, I don't know... Um, hold on. How would I mine with the rover? So now we've got the range extended, but I don't know how to mine with it. Rovers, drones. Yeah. How do you mine with it? <laughs> this is, I just don't know. All right, whatever. We don't need to go any farther. Let's just let's just get out there and get in it. <laughs> All right. That's awesome. So the uh, the rover has been extended uh, with the remote control, and that is awesome. So could I put like these um, antennas up all over the map and eventually be able to now. So here's the deal. Like from what I understand the road, this extends the Rover to this area. So I can use the remote control anywhere in this area. I'm thinking this is blocked by mountains or like cliffs. So I don't think I can use the Rover over here. Not that I'd want to anyway. So could I put another antenna over here and extend it? And from here, get the Rover all the way over here. If it's another antenna, I know I'd have to power it. You know, I just put down a, doesn't take a lot of power. I would basically just put down a um uh one small solar panel would would be fine unless it's nighttime, which could be a problem. Maybe a solar panel and a battery would be best. And then I might be able to take the rover all over the planet like that. I don't I don't think that's the case. I think you probably have to be within the range of the antenna you're using. But if I could put down multiple antennas, power them, and then be able to take the rover anywhere on the planet, like eventually, that would be freaking cool. Although it doesn't really do anything. I don't even know how to mine with it. I need to find out how to mine with it. I watched someone in a video mining with the rover with the remote control, but they didn't explain how to do it. So I have no idea how to do it. Um, or maybe I dreamed that. I don't know. It's been a crazy week for me, guys. Um, so <laughs> maybe maybe that didn't happen. I'm pretty sure it did, though. I'm pretty sure I saw someone mining with it. Uh, but like I said, they didn't explain how. All right, let's get out there and do some grinding. People have been mentioning in the comment section over the past like week or so, and I've been re I keep reading the comments and I keep forgetting about them. Um, but yeah, you don't really want to drive up to a POI. I don't think you want to drive at all in third person because there's something about driving in third person that causes. It, it, they think that that's the reason that stuff is falling through the world. So I mean, a reload takes care of it, and sometimes it's, it's just beneficial to drive in third person. But um, yeah, it's really interesting. Uh, I've been meaning to bring that up. You see, what the hell is that? What the? Okay, it's just a little thing there. I think that would be a problem. Uh, driving in third person, though, is very helpful. So, uh, you know, I think there's supposed to be a... I think there's supposed to be a tablet in this base. But I'm pretty sure I didn't find it yet. So let's, uh... Let's get to grinding. See if we can find this tablet. Yeah, I just need to grind. I need to get as much grinding experience as I can, and then I can make the uh, HQ. I really want to make the HQ. Someone was saying that they think the HQ might be the spot to go where, where you can control stuff with your remote control from inside the base, which would really help. Because, like I said, you know, if I have to stand outside the base to use a remote control, it's it's kind of it's kind of trash. Like, you know, personally, I, I kind of feel that way. But um, okay. I did see a hangar over here, and I kind of wanted to see if I could take that down, but it might cause issues if I get too close to it with radiation. So let's see if we can take this hangar down. Because this would give me a lot of experience. I'm pretty sure I can't. Wait, maybe I can. I think this is one I parked next to when I set up my, uh, my water stuff. Oh, hold on. Whatever. I'm taking it down. I'm just going to keep an eye on my health and see what this radiation does to me. So radiation doesn't seem like it's doing too much. Uh, is my health going down? Yeah, it is. Very slowly, though. Or maybe it wasn't. Actually, I don't see it going down now. I think I'm just going to take this whole thing out. I was also under, like, when I was going to grind POIs, I was grinding down stuff and letting everything fall. 
It's a bad idea. You really don't want to do that. Um, a couple videos ago, I had stuff that was floating. Uh, that could make stuff fall through the ground as well, so you have to reload. So it's probably best to clear out everything in there before you want to grind something. Um, but I wouldn't have been able to go in that one anyway because of the radiation. Or maybe I could, but I wouldn't have. Alright. Um, really not sure where this... I don't know. Maybe th maybe there's a tablet here. I, I Maybe like a month ago. This game's been out for a while. Maybe like a month ago, I, I believe I watched someone play. And I could have swore that they found a, a tablet in this in this area. So I'm going to keep searching for it. And I'm getting experience too, so it's fine. And then, uh, then we'll get home and we will spec into the HQ and see what that's all about. We are back at base in the workshop and I am going to go to the materials workbench and I wasn't really sure what I wanted to open up. I wanted to try the, I wanted to try the teleportation of vehicles. Um, I also wanted to try the HQ. Uh, I'm just going to go with the, um, main HQ. I, I could just materials. like do the teleporting Technology vehicles thing and try it and reload, increase. but nah, you know what? I kind of want the HQ. Advancement. All right, so where are we gonna put this bad boy? We gotta see how big it is. Uh, it is relatively early in the morning, so let's come on out here. Now this is gonna be like a control center. So if we're gonna do a control center, where would we want it? Um, I guess maybe, uh, will it fit there between that and this? I don't know, let's see how big it is. Shouldn't be that big. I mean, it's just a control center. Uh, where would it be? Main and Main hub. Oh, it's huge. Oh, okay. It's one with the stairs. Well, son of a biscuit. Um, before I started recording, I tried to see if I could fit this large rock rock crusher here. I can't do it. It's red. It won't put it down. Probably because the uh, terrain is not flat enough. Oh boy. So where the heck am I going to put this thing? This is going to be tough. I guess I could just, um, you know, I could probably pull this out around here. I really wish I could move this thing. Like, uh, I could, nah, I can't really, I mean, I guess I could do it. No, nah, I can't do it there. So either here or here, I guess I'll just do it right here to hell with it. Why not? Why the heck not? Let's get to grinding. I'm grind out this airlock. Grind out this airlock. And if I could just fit it right here, that would be fine. I, I probably would be able to. Yeah, there we go. Actually, it's not that big. Kind of weird placing stuff down, though. Uh, is that good? Yeah, it looks good to me. Now I'm thinking I might be able to fit it over here. Let's try. Let's try. I'd really like it not to be here. I could put it there if I have to. It's not the end of the world. But I'd prefer to put it over here. All right, so if I'm going to put it here, I would have to take out this. And I'm going to have to put a T-junction in there. Okay. And then we'd put the T-junction... Uh, corridors, there we go, and like so, and let's see if we can put it here. Yep, it looks like we can. It's not connected, it's, ugh, placing stuff down in this game is really tough, like why is this thing right in my freaking face? I can't even tell if that's lined up or not. Yeah, I don't understand why this thing's right in my face. It's kind of annoying. I'm not going to lie. And then when I do get it there, I'm in the way. All right, there we go. All right, cool. And then maybe, just maybe, we could try and connect this up with this. Although I'm pretty sure it won't work, but I might try it. We'll see. No, I can't walk through there. That's fine. This is a much better place for it, in my opinion. All right, it's expensive. Well, kind of. 20 cement. I got that cement, right? Uh, glass plates. Back of screws. Electronics. Moment of truth. I'm going to need a big circuit board, by the way. Not enough materials. All right, that's fine. Let's come over here and... 
I gotta put another piece. I, actually, that could probably be a four piece. No, that's a T junction, so that's not gonna work. Okay, fair enough. Four doors and normal with windows. People said that like people are telling me in the comments that your your base can take damage with the dust devils and stuff. I've never seen anything in my base damaged. That doesn't mean it's not damaged. It's just maybe I'm missing it. I don't know, but I've not seen anything like that. Now, where the heck is my rover? Where did I leave it? Oh, that's right. I did put it back in the uh, in the hangar. That's where I keep all my my main storage. They need to give us a real storage like real storage container. Like the storage container, I'm told, is just about as big as the fridge, which is garbage. Uh, I need some real like big storage containers to be able to place in this in this thing. Because this is where I got to keep all my stuff, and it takes forever to get over here. But here I am. But I say big, right? Big circuit board. All right, let's get back and build this thing. What do you What do you guys think? Uh, for those of you who don't know, what do you think the chances are I could connect that survival thing that I came down into the base? I think chances that I can connect that are like ten percent. Uh, it's not looking likely. Can I finish this from in here? No. Damn it. That would have been nice. <laughs> oh crap! I can't. Oh, I gotta go out the back because I I took out the uh, front entrance. Darn it! Equalizing pressure. Equalizing pressure. Suit power. Suit power. Seventy-five percent. Let's take a look at the batteries really quick. It's early in the morning, and this thing is is still like over half full. So we the power is not an issue right now. I don't know if it's going to be an issue. It might be maybe once I start growing crops again, which I will do. Uh, maybe even today. So we are going to need uh, airlocks, and then we're going to need the that thing, and then we're going to come over here, and we are going to look for a ninety degree. Oh yeah, this isn't this isn't going to work. There's no way. There's no way. Yeah, I'm most positive that's not going to work. I'm gonna leave it. Even even if it did work, they're not lined up properly. It's just this is a little off, but it's not. It's off, but it's not off enough to be made up for with the 90 degree angle turn. So the best I could do is that, and that, there's no way. They're not gonna line up. Why do I keep saying there's no way? Because there is no way, bro. Right, so let's go check out that control unit. Maybe I can uh, use the rover from the control from the HQ, the main HQ. That that would be pretty nice. Come on, it takes a little bit for these things to hook into the station at first. Oh, come on, did I finish it? Yeah, it looks finished to me. There we go. All right, here we are. Can I put stuff in here? I probably can. What would I put down here though? I guess like storage, but I don't. There's nothing. I would do it storage. My storage would be th this. And, oh, you can't. Okay. So I don't know what I could put down here. And there's nothing up here either. Okay, so there's nothing in here. And I don't think we could place anything in here. So let's see if we could use a remote from in here. Damn it. Why can't I use a remote? So is this, is this place really like completely useless? Wow. Okay. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something, but it seems pretty useless. Okay. No. It is what it is. Uh, I think we're going to go do some farming now. Which way to my farm? Farm living quarters. Thank you. Thank you. Very helpful. Very helpful. Although there's nothing in that farm that I could do with because I can't put a refrigerator in there for some reason. Um, I do have a fridge here. Here's all my stuff. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to grab this, 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 this. I think these are withered, but I'll take them anyway. This, we're gonna have to put some stuff away in here. Uh, this, 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 okay. That looks pretty good. So yeah, we come out here and then we go right here. All right, beautiful. So I wanna put, right, this is what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. 
want to start making the beat roots. Okay. Uh, where is the thing? There it is. Beautiful. Five. Wait. <laughs> Four. All right. Beat roots. All right. No more beat roots there. Uh, potatoes, potatoes, beet roots. No more beet roots. No beet roots, no beet roots, no beet roots. So we only have potatoes at this point. All right. So we'll close up. Oh. Close that. All right. Put that away, man. Close the freaking thing. Close the freaking thing, yeah? Open this one. Open this one. And then we go to four. And we do this. Like a machine gun. And then we go to this one and like a machine gun. And one more. Okay. So that's all looking good. All right, so let's close this. Let's close. Oh, I forgot to put down the ones I already had. Okay, hold on. I still have room for them. I still have room for them. I have ones that are like kind of grown uh, right here. These need to go. Wait, they withered like completely? Dude, they weren't even close to being withered. Ah, that sucks, man. That wasn't even close to being withered when I took it out of the fridge. I mean, it was low, but it wasn't that low. So I don't know why I went all the way over there. Got to come here. Suit power, 50%. And demand, demand, demand. We're going to have water issues, aren't we? Yep. Yep, we're going to have water issues. Demand, 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 demand. All right, so we do have some water saved up. So it's not going to be an issue right now. But let me just... One, uh, 0 0.3, 1 0.4, 0 0.5. 0 0 0.72, 1 0.2, 0 0.72, 1.2. Okay, so that's all looking good. All right, I think the next thing we need to do is get on out there and take care of the water, the water situation, which is just going to be adding more wells. No big deal. Um, right there, those can get thrown out. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with withered stuff, but no, we don't need that. We don't need that. We're going to throw all these out. I will take this with me and let's get out there and make some more wells. I think one more well would probably be enough, but I think I'm just going to make two just because I can. Right. Sleep deprivation right. Sleep oh. deprivation my ass. Alright, so I'm supposed to come out this way. Yeah, like that. And then I think I'm gonna need one spot in between them. Yep, I think so. And then this one right here can go right. Oh, that's weird. How it's like more than two spots? See, here's the thing. I want to leave. I want to leave room for the um, these things, but I don't know. Um, all right, whatever. Let's just make this one first. I'd like to leave room for those things on the sides, but I'm not gonna like super worry about it right now. Kind of deal with it. All right, and then another one. I think maybe I, once I've made one, it'll like, yeah. You know, see, that's like that looks off compared to what I did it before. And I don't appreciate that. That kind of pisses me off. I'm not going to lie. Uh, maybe I could do one. Nah, I'm going to do it on this side. All right. No, I guess it really doesn't matter that much. Yeah. All right. Whatever. It's fine. It'll be good enough for now. I don't need methane. And honestly, I don't really need oxygen that much either. So I could always move them later if I have to. It's not the end of the world. So this is where my batteries connect to, so go to there, and then go to here, and then, again, like, if I, if I don't like the way they're set up, I can always break them down later, it's not the end of the world. You do get all the resources back, so no harm, no foul. So how much do these all need now? Actually, let's see how much they're getting, because maybe it doesn't matter. Uh, 16.8. Probably gonna need more than that. I think this one's at 10. Yeah, you can see just by looking at it. So that's 10. 15. 10, 15, 20, 25. Alright, so we need 25. We'll get to we'll get to that for sure. Um, 
Oh, we gotta hook him into this. Crap, I forgot about this. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna need another one of these. What is that pump? That's a pump, right? I remember where the pumps are. Battery pack, battery transformer, EC. Let me find a pump and put one down. It's a little bit of a mess out here. Let me try and show you what I'm doing here. So this, this well, this well, this well, and this well. Um, these two are going into this pump. These two are going into this pump. These two pumps are going into this pump. This pump is going to my base. Let's go check the water really quick. If it's a lot of water, then I know I'm good to go and I can call it a day. And I know my crops will be good. And plus other crops, like there's gonna be a lot of water. I mean, theoretically, I should have doubled my water intake. So we'll see. Let's take a look. Uh, there we go, 21. Yeah, what was I getting before? I was getting like 11 something. Yeah, all right, that makes sense. Cool, so we now have uh, water. Our water issues are a thing of the past. We should be growing some pretty dope crops. I am going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.